Hey everyone, hi there. Wanted to share with you today how I get my artwork ready for framing. Everyone's got a little bit different method. This is what I found has worked for me so far. Here is a piece I'm getting ready to frame for an upcoming art show submission. Really happy with the mat this time. I'm usually so, it just, I get really stressed out choosing matte colors for a piece because it can either really help it or it can really hurt it. At best, you know, usually it's just, it's just there. If it's not distracting, that's great. But this one, I think this inner blue really picked out those highlights in the soap bubble there. So pretty happy about that. Let me take it off here and show you. This is what I call my cradle. It is, let me turn on the side here so you can see it. We've got 3 8 inch archival foam core backing. Same here with these strips that offer a little space between the artwork and the mat that rests on top. This allows any dust, little particles of pastel that fall off over time or get knocked off, allows it to fall down behind the mat so your mat stays clean on the front, which is nice, and gives you a little space there so it doesn't rub off. So I hope that makes sense. Um, holding the piece in, this is UART 600 grit pastel paper. And this tape here, I've got on the top and bottom, is framer's tape. Um, I'm not sure what else it's called. Um, very sticky. I cut it in little pieces there and I put it on top. Some people make little hinges and I've never gotten those to stick. So maybe I'm not using the right technique or maybe it's the wrong tape. I'm not, I don't know. But this is what I've got. Um, to glue these strips on I used, um, oh what's it called? Rubber cement. That lovely stuff either you love or you hate the smell of. I kind of like it. But it uh, reminds me of high school and college. Um, and I find I have to weight it down. Uh, I'll put a good amount of the glue on and stick these strips down and then you know, piece of uh, cardboard over it and then just some weights, nothing too heavy, and let that stay on there for, oh gosh, at least half a day, more if I've got time. Um, and then what, what I find if I don't do that is that this paper on top of the um, foam core base starts to pull away and buckle a little bit. Not a huge deal, it's gonna be in a frame, it's gonna hold everything together, but you know, you want it to look nice as possible, even if it's not gonna be seen. So there you have it. That is how I get my artwork ready for framing. I hope you like this video. If you do, give me a thumbs up there down below. I'm gonna try and post more over time. Um, if you're looking to f uh, see more of what I do, you can follow or support me on Patreon. Even a dollar there helps. I've also got Facebook, Instagram and Pinterest. You can see those links up in my channel header there. So, hope you enjoyed it and I hope you have a great day full of art.